the consensus ranking on Rashad White is running back 42. And as I mentioned earlier in the live stream, over the last four weeks, Rashad White has three of his four games, at least 37% of the snaps. He's been getting more involved. Three of the last four games, four targets or more. Um, he's had 32 or more total yards three of the last four games. And if he falls in the end zone, we're talking about a back end running back two. Just so happens. Now, he's only had three red zone carries on the season, so I still think that's mostly the Leonard Fournette role, but we've seen an increase of usage um, over the last four weeks for Rashad White. I think that this, once again, is a relatively plus matchup, especially for the receiving back in this game, and Leonard Fournette and Rashad White seem to be splitting that receiving work uh, this is uh, a Baltimore team that gives up the fifth most running back points through receptions so far. And I want to be higher than the consensus running back 42 is the consensus on Rashad white and looking at the range of rankers as well. I want to be higher than, than running back 42. The range of rankers are running back. 35 is the highest all the way down to running back 51. So if I'm splitting the difference there, you know, looking at is it going to be a running back 42 or so? No, I want to be higher on Rashad White. I mean, running back 42, he's finished as the running back uh, 41 or better three of the last four weeks. With an increased role, I think this is more of a floor ranking than a ceiling ranking. So I wouldn't be of afraid of moving uh, Rashad white into that, like running back 35 or so spot uh, of desperation, running back back and running back three. If you're really, really in need of, uh, of a running back going into Thursday night football. And of course you don't want to start Rashad white in your flex spot. If you're starting, uh, if you're playing to start him, move him into one of that, those running back spots. And then you're just going to have to move one of your running backs into the flex spot. Uh, it's just a smarter play just in case something happens between now and Sunday when the rest of the games go off, unless it's like a Monday game, of course. <laughs>